Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for watching. So today I'm going to share five new posts to story, story ideas for your Instagram. So if that is something that you're interested in, then please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel if you have not already or if you find this video helpful. And without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna start screen recording and let's go into my Instagram. Now, the first story is very simple, very aesthetic, minimalistic. So this is just a picture of my hair. So I'm gonna say add post to your stories. We're gonna create a nice, like a nice brown nudie background. And then you're gonna tap on the letters and then you're gonna scroll all the way back to the second, like it's a very thin font and you're gonna increase the size. And then you're just going to create almost like a film type of filter or like a effect to it and then do that again and you're going to overlap these two and then you're going to find a gif that says new post so you can choose any kind of gif that you want i'm just like a quite a, like aesthetic minimal one because the post is so minimal we don't want to like overdo it let's go with this one and i'm going to put it over essentially what the post is about which is actually the hair clip that is in my hair so because you created like this film like type of filter over it it's very enticing to want to you know click on it to see you know what is actually in this picture and because the new post gift sticker whatever you call it is over the part of my hair the second one is also quite minimal i really like this one because it's a quick on the go one by the way if you have not already please go follow me on instagram okay so let's do this one i'm gonna say add to story yeah that's quite nice okay and then i'm gonna shift a little bit to the side so you can see like it's a collage but you can only see two pictures so that is also going to entice your audience to want to you know click on it to see more and then i'm gonna type Although I'm going to choose the last font in the font row and I'm going to do capitals new, highlight that, click on the color wheel, click on the eyedropper and I think I'm going to select my skin. Let's select my skin. First I'm going to do in another font. Um, oh no, let me... Okay, let me keep it that font. Yeah, let's go my skin again. So post is a darker color, so you're gonna create a nice contrast. And then let's search for a heart or like. Let's search for like. There we go. I'm gonna choose that one and I'm just gonna put it over there. And that is also one of the many minimalistic ones you can choose from. I kind of like this one because more of my aesthetic and you can see the new post font colors, so the color of the, the font kind of matches in with my aesthetic and it's the white and the kind of like golden reddish shades and then the pampas in the background and everything like that. So quite like that one. Okay, so for the third one, this, was, this one is gonna take you a little while to do, or not that long, but it's gonna take some time. So what you want to do is you're not going to post new to stories. You're going to go into your stories and then you're going to click your most recent post, whether it be an outfit or makeup or whatever. So let me choose this one. And then what you're going to do is you're going to screen grab it in stories and then you're going to swipe through the filters until you get the black and white one. Then you're going to go back into your pictures and then you're going to crop out, let's say, a piece of the picture. So let's, I'm just gonna crop out that piece of the picture. And then you can just say copy photo. And then you can go back into Instagram stories, it's gonna paste. And then all that you have to do is kind of match it with your image. And this is why I say it's going to take a while. Okay, so now that you have that so your face and whatever is in um, black and white and then the outfit which is if you are going for 
an outfit picture is kind of like the center of attention pick another font so let's say this font and then and then we're going to say just new post and then you can just add some lines or scribbles or whatever if you wanted to and then i'm just gonna long hold click and then say select so it's just gonna select the word new i'm gonna go to the eyedropper and i'm just gonna select a color let's say let's, let me select the color of the flannel shirts long hold again i'm gonna do post it's gonna be a separate color so i'm gonna make that one white that is a really creative way of showing that you have a new post and that's it for number three let's move on to number four okay so for number four let's just choose this image okay so so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to screen grab it and then i'm gonna go into my pictures and i'm going to crop out that keep in my name then i'm going going to go to new post so i'm going to add the new post i'm going to go into the sticker i'm going to scroll down you can see there's all of my images then i'm just going to scroll down until i find those pictures that i took and i'm going to select a picture that i took at the same time but obviously at a different angle so let me choose so let me choose this one um and i'm going to put that over the whole screen then i'm going to go back into sticker and i'm going to select the one that i screen grabbed and i want to place it so whenever someone like clicks on the picture it will obviously open up so you can either do a gradient if you wanted to i'm going to keep it as is uh, then search click and then you can choose whichever mouse click you want to work with i kind of like this one and then that's basically just going to indicate to your followers to click on the post and it's going to look so much nicer because how did you get the like where your name like your instagram name is onto the back of another picture it will fit your feed um and obviously it's going to look very aesthetic and clean and obviously they're gonna wonder how did you do this or whatever but it also tells a story on what the post is about so whether it is makeup and outfits food jewelry this was for jewelry um whatever the post is about it's gonna entice them to want to click on it and then for the last new post to stories idea so basically it's going to be the same concept you're going to take any picture that you like so i'm going to do this one i'm going to screen grab that one i'm going to go back into my photos i'm going to crop it out but this time i'm going to crop out my name and everything then i'm going to go back into instagram and then just choose if you did a carousel image or then just choose any picture so i'm going to do this one go back into images and this one i'm going to crop like the first one done okay then go back into stories create a story okay so then i'm gonna take any picture that i like that's like a collage style picture Go into the sticker tab, scroll down, go into the photo one and then just kind of center it in the middle and literally just say new post. Put it like so and there you have it. It's quite minimalistic. It's going to take you a little while but it's quite easy to do and it's very different from the other people's new post kind of images but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up if you did let me know which one is your favorite in the comments down below i would love to share more of my tips and tricks and then i think that is all you guys really hope you enjoyed this video and i hope to see you guys in my next video bye guys Mwah.